The Belgian Defense Ministry announced the potential resumption of production for the Wolf-type armored trucks, with all 199 units expected to be delivered by 2025. This marks significant progress for a project that recently faced delays due to the financial struggles of Jankel Armoring Limited, the British supplier responsible for the Fox and Wolf wheeled vehicles used by the Belgian military. The Wolf LTTV is a versatile armored vehicle designed to carry a crew of 10, 8 fully equipped soldiers in the rear, a driver and a vehicle commander. With an empty weight of 9.2 tons, it reaches 10.8 tons in full-service configuration, making it well-suited for deployment with paratrooper units. The vehicle also has impressive mobility, with a range of 1,200 km, making it ideal for long-duration missions. The LTTV offers both automatic and manual transmission modes, allowing for flexible performance in off-road conditions or in case of automatic transmission failure. This versatility enhances its utility across various operational environments. Earlier in 2024, Jankel, which also manufactures the Fox Rapid Reaction Vehicle, RRV, for Belgium's Special Operations Group, encountered severe financial issues. The company initiated a judicial restructuring process on March 8, raising concerns about its ability to fulfill a critical contract signed in 2018 for the delivery of 199 LTTVs to the Belgian Army. The contract, valued at 67 million euros, aims to replace the aging Unimog models that have been in service since the mid-1990s, providing the Belgian armed forces with enhanced transport and logistical capabilities. To address these concerns, MP Aerospace, a Canadian-based company, acquired parts of Jankel's operations in June 2024, ensuring the continuity of key contracts. This acquisition enabled the Fox and Wolf vehicle production to continue without significant interruption allowing for the planned completion of the vehicle delivery program by 2025. The Wolf LTTV is a highly adaptable vehicle designed with a modular configuration. It features interchangeable mission modules, allowing the vehicle to be reconfigured based on specific operational requirements. This modularity is crucial for Belgium's armed forces, as it ensures the full interoperability of the LTTV with the existing Fox RRV fleet. The shared compatibility across these vehicles enhances logistical efficiency and operational flexibility. In terms of protection, the Wolf LTTV comes equipped with a removable ballistic protection kit, a rollover protection system, ROPS, and various weapon mounts and communication subsystems. For added security, the vehicle includes an armored floor and bullet-resistant front windshields. Additionally, removable protection kits, RPK, can be installed on the cabin doors and cargo area, providing enhanced security depending on mission needs. The contract to supply Belgium with new armored vehicles began taking shape in 2017, when the Belgian Defense Ministry approved the acquisition of 199 LTTVs. These vehicles were intended for the Special Operations Group and Paratrooper units, aiming to replace the aging Unimog 1350L models that have been in service for nearly three decades. By June 2024, NP Aerospace's acquisition of Jankel's operations stabilized the Wolf LTTV production. Following thorough financial and security audits, the acquisition officially took effect on June 4, ensuring the production of Fox and Wolf vehicles would continue. The Belgian Defense Ministry confirmed in September 2024 that all contracts for both vehicle types had been successfully transferred to NP Aerospace, allowing the program to move forward toward its 2025 completion target. The Wolf LTTV's development is part of a broader strategy to modernize Belgium's military vehicle fleet. By replacing older models with more advanced and adaptable vehicles, the Belgian armed forces aim to enhance their operational readiness and logistical capabilities. The LTTV is designed with modern military requirements in mind, offering protection, adaptability, and operational endurance across varied environments. Its modular design allows it to cater to different mission needs from troop transport to specialized operations. The collaboration with MP Aerospace ensures that Belgium will have access to advanced military vehicle support and production, securing long-term operational viability for the Fox and Wolf fleets. The resumption of Wolf-type armored truck production is a positive development for the Belgian military. After overcoming the financial hurdles faced by Jankel, the integration of MP Aerospace into the vehicle's production process ensures the continuation of this critical program. With all 199 LTTVs expected to be delivered by 2025, Belgium's armed forces are set to receive modern, mission-adaptable vehicles that will significantly enhance their tactical and logistical capabilities in the coming years.